Hi guys, my name is Deborah, and I'm going to be one of your Chi Alpha officers next year. So I just want to share a little bit with you about kind of what God has done in my life since I've uh, got to Stanford and then also what I'm really looking forward to for next year. Uh, so coming to Stanford, I really had never had um, much of a Christian community and I was super excited to get involved uh, in just a strong community where I could learn and grow toward God. Uh, and that's exactly what I found in Chi Alpha. It was something that um, I think I was learning a lot uh, because of Chi Alpha and the friends that I made. I was learning a lot about how to rest in community, how to just have joy in that. And there was so much joy um, in that in my first year, especially. Um, and then I think I was also learning kind of how do I give back? How do I become a part of that type of community? Um, how do I uh, encourage others just as others were encouraging me, were mentoring me? Uh, so that was a big thing theme kind of of my first year at Stanford. Uh, going into my second year, that actually almost became more of a crutch. I think I started to rest so much in community um, that God, what God really started to reveal to me through his word, but also through other people, um, was that I needed to not lean so heavily on other people and lean a little bit more on him. Um, that my faith needed to be my own and I needed to focus on developing that. Um, uh, separately just from the joy that I had from community. Um, so that's been something in solitude, in silence, those types of things have been coming to mind a lot for me over the year. Um, and then really throughout the entire time, but especially recently um, since quarantine stuff started, then I think God has been talking to me a lot um, through his word about kind of what it means to, to truly be dependent on God, uh, to be desiring him. And that's kind of been my prayer um, for two years now, but really especially right now, to just uh, put more and more trust in him, uh, to find him sufficient, uh, more than sufficient, uh, even if I'm separated from friends, even if I'm separated from a lot of the things that I consider to be comfortable, um, that I would just find that love, that I would feel his love, um, that I would be able to love him, and that would be a central aspect of my life. Um, so just kind of going into next year, um, I think one of my main prayers is just for uh, boldness, uh, specifically for outreach. I think that we do a great job in Chi Alpha um, from time to time doing various different outreach events or even just reaching out to people that we know on a one-on-one -on -one basis uh, to really spread God's kingdom. Uh, and I think that we could do better. And so for those of you who have met me, this may come as a surprise, but I actually struggle a lot with boldness, specifically in this area. And if there's any area that you don't want to struggle with boldness, this is it. So my prayer is that I, with all of you, um, would grow in boldness next year and that we would see amazing fruit from that. So I'm honored uh, to have been elected. I'm really excited to serve you guys next year, and I can't wait until we can all be back on campus together. Thanks.